Welcome. On behalf of Peripatetic Philosophy, we are coming to you live June 2019 from Cape of Sunion in the Temple of Poseidon. Something that's coming up in the discussion board in the youth intro is the fear and shame discussion. And what we want to ask ourselves is, what do you guys think about this? If you have a whole variety of just actions, and the big pool of just actions, are part of them holy and pious actions, as Euthyphro believes, or is the whole gamut holy and pious actions, as Socrates at least entertains for a second. So we want to think about that. If you're an atheist, pretend to be a theist and think what's most rational for the theist, your theistic friend. Or if you're a theist, Jew, Muslim, Christian, Sikh, some Hindus, and so on, what do you think about this? Now, from the Christian perspective, you have some interesting passages. Jesus says in Matthew 25 uh, to his disciples a little parable about the king who didn't take care of uh, the sick, those in prison, and so on. He says, if you don't take care of these people, you're not taking care of me. And Paul in Colossians 3.23 says, Do all these things not unto men, but unto, unto the Lord. Now, so think about particular instances of just actions. Taking care of a friend, being nice to a friend, loving them, being generous. And think if those things could be in the sphere of both religious pious, holy actions, and just actions, or if pious, holy, just actions are only a subset, as you their All right, we'll leave you full of Cape Studio. This is beautiful. Check this out sometime. It's about an hour, hour and a half from Athens. See you soon. I'm tougher on behalf of Parapetetic Philosophy.